Welcome back to Google Guru. Today I've got a quick tip for you for Google Spreadsheets that'll help make the transition from Excel a little bit easier. So I'm going to open up this spreadsheet here, which is a teacher schedule with the teachers in the left hand column and the days of the week in this row across. Now if I think this spreadsheet would look better if the rows and columns were reversed, with Excel I would just use a transpose copy and paste function. But unfortunately there's not something like that in spreadsheets, but there is a formula that you can use. So to use this, I'll just type in the formula equal sign transpose, select my range, close parentheses, and hit enter. As you can see, the days of the week are now on the left hand side, and the teachers are in the row across. I'm just going to show you one more example here on the second sheet. So in this case, I have my customer classes ranked from small, medium, large, enterprise, and then dates across with my number of customers and the uh, values right here. So let's say that I want to transpose this data down here and then replace the old data. So I'll use the same formula, equal sign, transpose, select my range, close parentheses, and enter. I'll just cut this range and paste over top of the old data. And then I can just delete this down here and I have a brand new table. So that's all I have for you today. There's a lot of talk about how Google Spreadsheets can't really compare to Excel, but I think this is one of the cases where you can use a formula within Google Spreadsheets that can take the place of a function that you would find in Excel.